Yo guys, what is going on and welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercar video episode 52 with me cool guy and you the awesome viewers. In the last episode guys we got ourselves the Neville from the RTG, we also got ourselves two awesome elite cards, like really absolutely awesome elite cards, very very happy with that. Even though at this point elite cards aren't exactly what I'm looking for, the cards were awesome. If you haven't checked that video make sure you go check it before this one. Because there's going to be a lot of awesome shit in this video, alright? Um, I named uh, an episode, well, it must have been about 15 episodes ago, something like that, maybe 10 episodes ago, maybe like less, uh, Pros for Days. This episode may be called, probably will be called Pros for Days 2, because look at these pros. Alright, um, so just a quick shout out really quickly to, uh, an, uh, you know, an absolute knobhead, which is D2. Um, if you're watching this video, dude, you see, it didn't take me two weeks to pro Neville, it took me like two days, so yeah, that's not bad, even though you probably, you know, 90% of people pro him in the first, like, couple of hours of getting him, you know, it took me two weeks for Alexa Bliss, it took me a couple of days for Neville, I've just got back from taking my exam today, I left this morning, and I got back about an hour and a half ago, so yeah, I was playing in the train pretty much the whole time, and that's why, um, like three hours there, three hours back in the train, and that's why I am ready to pro all of these beautiful cards you guys see, except the Brock, Brock Lesnar, uh, I've literally played no games with either of the cards, so mm, yeah, we're gonna have to get moving with that, but that's pretty cool, I'm um, gonna get Brock Lesnar, that is gonna be sick, uh, for catalog, and he will, I think, just make it in my team as well. So, let's quickly have a look, guys, at what we have to do. Um, the two Baron Corbins are done, except leveling up this Baron Corbin. Uh, both Nijaxes are pretty much done, except this one, who has one more power game and one more toughness game, and I also have to level up five more levels. So let's get ahead and do that now, and then we'll pro them. And it'll be, again, I think another quite a short episode today. Tomorrow, um, the new event is out. Well, well, this event actually got um, prolonged, which I don't know why. Because um, I don't, re you know, I don't remember there being anything wrong with it. Just the fact that people got legendary Nikki Bellas for some reason. I included got a legendary Nikki Bella. Really bizarre. Um, we'd finished getting the Nia Jax, and then I went back on the game after I'd finished streaming, and then it said claim reward. I was really confused. I claimed the reward. Boom! <laughs> legendary Nikki Bella popped up. I, I don't know. And everyone starts saying they got the Nikki Bellas, so I got worried that maybe they were going to take it away, and I'd lose my Nia Jax, but. That didn't happen, and we're good. So we played a toughness game there, so all I need to do is play a pound game, and while we do that, I'm going to quickly have a little talk about the awesome episode of Monday Night Raw we had. When I say awesome, I use that term like, you know, I'm using that term very like lightly, okay? It was a good episode of Monday Night Raw, which is not something you hear every week or every year, to be honest. But it was actually quite a decent episode, um, especially the ending, obviously. And there we go, there's our power game, we got quite lucky with that. Um... But it was actually the ending was the ending was amazing. I don't like the fact that they just got in the ring and stared at each other and then boom, end them on in that raw. I'd have liked maybe you know a little promo in there, but whatever, whatever. You can't have everything. Um, so yeah, let me quickly go through raw. Um, just like the brief things I have to say about it, which is um, the Roman Reigns, Chris Jericho, and that kind of little debacle. That was alright, I don't like the fact that um, Chris Jericho can't win clean against Roman Reigns, even though I know it would make Roman Reigns look weak as he is a challenger now for the Universal title going into the main event at Royal Rumble, so I understand that. And I don't also, I don't like the fact that Roman Reigns manages to beat up not one, but two uh, champions, like two WWE Raw champions right now, not just one, but two, he gets the better of both of them, which again makes Roman Reigns look way stronger than he is, and that's why that's a good reason why not many people like Roman Reigns. I know, you know, some some huge Roman Reigns fans. There's a couple of them who watch these videos. You know, couple. I've got there's a couple Roman Reigns fans who watch me. So for all of you guys who don't understand why just everyone hates Roman Reigns, because you'd be like, oh, I love Roman Reigns. Why would anybody hate him? Because he's booked. Like, literally, like, you can, you you know, in matches, you know, their his opponents will use, like, two or three times their finisher on him, and nothing, he'll just kick out two, yet yeah, one spear, boom, down, and three count, and that's it. So, you know, that is why, anyway, that segment was, in, you know, it was alright, you know, whenever you see Chris Jericho, is always fun, and, uh, yeah, I kind of enjoyed it, it was alright, but they're, they're, those are the complaints I have about it that I just mentioned. Um, then we had that weird, that really weird like tag team match with, the, with Tyson O'Neill, the New Day, Braun Strowman, and you know all the in the you know the Enzo and Cass and all of that. That was you know 
I guess it was what it is. It is what it is. Uh, it was, I'm not going to talk too much about that. The cruise rates. I'm, I'm missing something with this whole Alicia Fox, Noam Dar, and Tadjika Alexander. Last, I had any idea about this. Might have happened last week because I, I probably skipped through that. I didn't realise Alicia Fox was now with Noam Dar and against... Uh, I didn't understand that. Um, but clearly, she must have changed sides, which is alright. Okay, cool. You know, whatever, whatever. Cruise rates aren't exactly the most interesting thing. Uh, Seamus and then the Bullet Club. That was... Um, the Bullet Club getting the win, and it's going to be, we'll, you know, we'll see that match on the kickoff show, which, you know, it is, again, I don't, I don't, you know, I think Sheamus and Bo Cesaro are really good and shouldn't have to be on the kickoff show, and, you know, same for the Bullet Club, they're amazing in Japan, they're, they're good, they're, they're, they're much better than how they're being booked, now it's a bit better because they're in the title shot at least, but, yeah, that's all of that done, and I think we have two more things to talk about, which is Sami Zayn versus Seth Rollins, which is a good match, very good match, um, I enjoyed it. Um, Seth Rollins isn't going to be in the Royal Rumble. Uh, but yeah, that's that's a thing. You know, I'm not sure if he will be or if he's going to figure out a way to be in it or if he's not. I personally don't care if he's in it or not. Just one more wrestler who I don't think should really be in it because he's had such a push recently. But because he's going to have this feud with Triple H, which means he will be at WrestleMania, which that's all good. So it's kind of it's not necessary to put him in the Royal Rumble because we know he's not going to win it because he is going to have the feud with Triple H. So it makes sense um, not to have him in the Royal Rumble. And that's pretty much all I have to say about that. And then obviously the Brock Lesnar, the Goldberg and the Undertaker, that was all. That was awesome. Um, obviously just having all those three wrestlers in the ring is amazing. Uh, first ever time the Goldberg and the Undertaker are in the ring together. Don't quote me on that, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but yeah, overall, solid episode of Raw. Um, you know, I still don't think it's as good as SmackDown. By the way, I don't know why I'm playing so many more wild matches, just what I'm talking about Raw that I'm playing. This will be the last one, and then we'll get those cards pro Um But yeah, that's what I have to say about it, and uh, yeah, tell me in the comments what you guys thought about Raw. Uh, tomorrow, I'm going to uh, record it today, probably after this video, get it recorded, just, you know, that way I can relax tomorrow, get it recorded, and upload it about tomorrow afternoon, or tomorrow, you know, lunchtime-ish, The my Raw Rumble predictions. So if you guys want to know what I have to say and what I think is going to happen at the Royal Rumble, then make sure you guys watch that video tomorrow. Um, and apart from that, also I'm going to be recording an Immortals video today, which I'll be uploading tomorrow as well. So yeah, tomorrow we might have an abundance of, of, of videos on the channel. Um, the Royal Rumble video has to come out tomorrow, and obviously there's always going to be a supercar video, so maybe as I'm, I'm uploading the Royal Rumble predictions, maybe I'll wait till Thursday for the Immortals video, I think that's what I'm going to do. You guys absolutely blew, I played another game, I'm, an, I'm what, what is wrong with me? Um, yeah, the, the Immortals video is actually the, not the last video, the video before that, and I asked for 60 likes and I'm going to open that massive pack. Guys, so 94 likes, mind absolutely blown, so thank you for that guys, it's absolutely insane. Um, I promised you guys I'd open a pack. I'm not gonna, I'm, you know, I'm not gonna just float over it. I never thought it would hit 60 likes, and I just thought I could get away with it. You know, I, I said it. I, I set the like goal. It's my own damn fault, really. And uh, and yeah, we're gonna open the pack for you guys because um, did you guys deserve it? You guys were insane. That's got 94 likes and no dislikes. That is my best like to dislike ratio because we have no dislikes on the video. So if you guys haven't checked that video out, go smash a like on that video. Let's see if we can reach 100 likes because that would be absolutely awesome. Um, and yeah, for some people who said, oh, don't buy, don't spend money on the game, don't spend money on it, just hack, do that, do that. I'm not going to hack the game, because what is the point of playing a game if you can just have unlimited coins and do, you know, it's just stupid. I play the game because I enjoy it, therefore, you know, there's no point of playing it if you can just have every, it's like, if you could just have, if you have every single Ultimate Pro in the game and every single event card in the game and, and it was just, there's just, what's the point? What's the point if you already have everything? I don't know. I don't know. But, um... Oh my god, I got into another game. Are you serious? No, screw that. Screw that. There's no way. There's no way I'm letting that slide. What is wrong with me? <laughs> Seriously. Oh my god. I, I, I need to go get tested, man. Like, no joke. I need to go get tested. Oh my goodness. All right. All right, let's forget, let's forget that that happened again. <laughs> and, uh, and let's get on to my cards. We need to train up a couple of cards. As I mentioned, one of the Baron Corbin, which is this one. I'm not gonna have enough cards to upgrade both of them, so yeah, let me just do that real quick. Pulled a Sheamus just before starting this video. There we go. He is done. And there we go. There we go. Baron Corbin is gonna get pro in. That was obviously not enough. Select all. Screw it. There we go. Oh my god, are you actually serious right now? All right, I'm gonna do something that I never do. I never do this, but I'm gonna do it. 
because we need to we need to get some cards. It's as simple as that. We need some cards. Let's go all the way down to um, sixteen thousand. Sixteen thousand. I'm gonna grind money in the bank. Um, anyways, like I really am gonna start focusing on money in the bank soon. So let me just get enough picks because. Yeah, I need to make the video interesting for you guys, and I need to upgrade these cards. I probably should have done it before, um, which is my bad. Oh, I need to get the picks now, don't I? Jesus, I'm not prepared at all for any of this. Uh, where do I need to go? Uh, we, need to, <laughs> we need to play another world mode game. Alright, this is going to be a longer video than I thought. I hope you guys enjoy it. Smash a like on the video if you guys are enjoying it. For all the ultimate pros you guys are going to see in a bit. Um, for the next video, I've got something awesome as well to show you guys, which is my um, 11,500k ladder reward, which is an ultimate uh, female, as I know. I, I've, my last video was first ultimate pro diva, and I have about two or three people saying, hey, it's females. I still call them divas just because I prefer saying I just it's easier, and I just prefer saying diva than female wrestler or woman with, I don't know, I don't know, I just... It just comes more naturally. It's still called Total Divas, so as long as they don't change Total Divas to anything else, I will still call them Divas, okay? And if you've got a problem for that, I've only got three words for you. Deal with it. Okay? <laughs> it's as simple as that. Um, Alright, let's get our 35 picks real quick. Hopefully we can pull maybe um, a couple WrestleManias, maybe a SummerSlam card. I'm dreaming. I know I am, but it would be nice if we could. <clears throat> game. <clears throat> it would be nice if we could, I said. I don't something's telling me that the game isn't actually listening to me right now. No, it doesn't seem like it, it does it. Alright, let's just finish our picks. Um oh look at all these uncommons, man. What is this? Is it's gonna give me a rare or a super rare. I'm calling it right now. Probably enhancement as well. Look look at it, look at it, look at it, it's gonna go down to the Yeah, super rare enhancement, called it. Caught it, caught it, caught it, and it'll probably give me like a rare retired wrestler. Now I'm calling it a rare wrestler who is retired. Come on, come on, come on, please just give that to me now. Give me like, give me like a, I don't know, just like a, a hillbilly gym rare card. <laughs> um, oh my god, are you, are you serious right now? Oh, okay, I'll take a legendary. Give me that legendary, and that's a little bit better than uncommon, isn't it? Um, should, should be enough to get Baron Corbin up to level 45. It most definitely will. That should do it alone. Perfect. He is now level 45. I've got three tokens to use on him. Um, he's a power toughness guy. I did, what did I do with him? I, why did I put it on Charisma? Wait, is, no, he might be better. At, okay, let me just have a look real quick what I did here. I'm going to do the same as I did before. We're going to put it all on Charisma. Because his power is actually really bad. There we go, guys. So these two cards can already be proed, which is what we're going to do. Um, I'm just checking because I don't want to silver star this card. No. <laughs> um, I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> um, every time I mention silver star and every time I think about it, I, I'm gonna re it's going to remind me of you, man. You, you know who you are if you're watching this. <laughs> Uh, and you're done level 45, 40, 40, and you are level 4, you're level 45, 20, 40, 40, 40, all tokens used. Perfect! Let's get him unlocked. Let's go ahead and combine him, and there we go guys, there's another Ultimate Pro, my first, my second Smackdown Ultimate Pro. There we go, absolutely awesome, we'll get him in locked in just a second, we're going to do the exact same with, um, no. <laughs> you see the bar looks full, so it's e you can easily get mistaken and just... And think that, um, and yeah, think that she's like level 45. I, I can understand like making that mistake. Like, it's, it's something that is very, very easy to do. So, this is the one we need to upgrade. Let's get that ultimate card on her, which is gonna be a bit overkill. I just, you know, I wanna, I wanna do this in the video. Let's get these two belts on Charisma because Alexa Bliss is a speed and proxin speed, so we don't need any speed at all on Nia Jax. I don't need any speed on Nijax. Please tell me I don't put any speed on Nijax. Boom, that's one done. And that is the second one done. Okay, 40, 40, 40, 40. All tokens used, level 45. And in the proc, that is good. Level 45, all tokens used, 40, 40, 40, 40. And 40 and 20 in the proc. Boom, boom. My first ever Ultimate Diva Pro. Get in there. Awesome. Awesome, 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 awesome. And now the man that Gravity forgot and then the man that WWE forgot and the man that now is awesome and WWE have not, it hasn't forgotten, 
Mr. Oh, and the, <laughs> the man, WWE forgot his first name, Mr. Neville, a.k.a. Adrian Neville. Oh, I tried to be funny there, it didn't work, did it? Uh, 40, 40, 40, 40, and 20 in the ability. And then level 45, all tokens used, 40, 40, 40, 40, and 20 in the rock. Let's get him. Ah, so close, so close, so close. Um, swapity, swap, swapity, swap, swap. Uh, ultimate, what's he going to put me in? Ult halfway through ultimate, okay. Um, boom, my cards. And yeah, let's combine him, and there we go! Another event card, that's my third event card, get that gold star on him. Now, let's go ahead and go on general cards, and let's make sure we lock not one of them, not two of them, but all of them. Uh, locked. Where's the other one? Uh, locked. Let me just compare to that, so, like 23, 23, and then 21, 22, wow, okay, that's a huge difference. And then lock that Nijack. So lock, lock, lock. Everyone's locked. That's all good. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Really do massively appreciate it. Once they are all leveled up and that is all done, my decks are going to look really good. Neville is already in here because he's just that good. Um, yeah, um, Nijack is already in there and she hasn't even been leveled up yet. And who else? Who else? Who else? Uh, Baron Corbin is going to you know, be in here as well. So yeah, there we go. Guys, I am, you know, still, um, that hasn't changed really anything for my rank because I can't be better than Ultimate Plus Plus. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Smack that like button if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Till then, take care and peace out.